Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Jamarit coming to you today with a brand new video, boys. And today, we're talking about my Thanksgiving plans as well as the broken game. So let's get right into the video. So guys, welcome to another video on the channel. And today, guys, I want to talk briefly about my Thanksgiving plans and then also talk about the state of the game, guys, because in my opinion, there are so many things wrong with it. First and foremost, let's jump into the event. It's nice to get an event, but there are so many underlying issues with the game. It's quite hard to enjoy it, for me anyway. So I'll just talk firstly about the rewards. Now, I've obviously just gone through and collected up these uh, first three rewards because, you know, you have to do them to work off onto the other paths. But then, guys, in terms of what I'm going to be doing, I'm probably not going to be going uh, for the players. None of the players really interest me. Um, and, you know, such an early event in the season, the players are bound to be not that great. I mean, they may be if you want to make, like, an American team or something like that. But for me, that's not the route that I'm going to be taking. I'm going to be focusing on things like uh, skill boost as well as, you know, gems, XP, and that sort of stuff. So that's what I'll be working towards. Maybe uh, if we do get lucky enough, um, I will be able to get one good player, but we'll have to wait and see. There's a bit of chance in this event, and we'll talk about that in a bit more detail. I'm not sure if I will be unlocking this. Um, we'll have to wait and see, but I don't think I'll have the resources at this moment in time to get my players up to 91 overall. What I want to talk about, guys, is just sort of uh, my plans in terms of this. Now, what I've been doing so far is just obviously doing the events as well as the ads and... I've just been saving guys like my plan is and probably most people's plan is by now is to save up 50 of each food and open up 19 of the one plates once we've got 50 of each food unlock another plate and then get the special plate and hope to pull the plate that does have uh the offer for 50 food as well as giving 350 uh, thanksgiving points because there is also another offer that i think is for 25 food um, which is okay still as well, but I think that the best bang for the buck is the 51 uh, But that's my plan guys, you know, just taking it slowly once we do get everything up to 50 um, We will be able to sort of advance a bit more quickly, but I've just been taking it easy You can see I've only opened up um, nine of the rewards so far and that was evident in my uh, 18 Thanksgiving points, but not all that much to the event guys It's just one that you got to take your time with um, the rewards obviously a lot of people are saying that the rewards aren't great, but thing is that it's so early on in the season guys you know the rewards are not going to be the greatest and obviously as the season does progress rewards will get uh, bigger and better but what I want to take my time and talk about in a bit more detail guys is just the state of the game because for me there are a whole bunch of problems with it first and foremost a crippling effect of the game at the moment is that a lot of people are having so many problems trying to get access to ads that affects so many things, we know. We're talking about Team of the Week, we're talking about Stamina for Ads, we're talking about Thanksgiving, Campaigns, you know, with the Weekly Rewards. Um, there's also the Scouting as well, there's probably a few others that I've forgotten, but Ads are crucial, guys, and a lot of people are having problems. I think some people are saying that the problem has occurred after maximizing your ads for Stamina, and then the uh, ad limit is just not reset. I'm not sure exactly what the problem is, but it's huge, guys. And people are missing out on so many rewards because of this. That needs to be fixed, like, ASAP. I'm not sure if it's still a problem, um, but from the time of recording this, I've still heard people have huge problems with it. Another thing is that corners and verse attack, guys, are still broken. Like, corners are so, so broken in verse attack. They literally decide whether or not you will win. For now, I've pretty much um, stopped playing versus attack because I just don't enjoy it. I've been playing a bit more head-to-head, -head, but there's still a few uh, problems in head-to-head. -head. Like, I'll find that sometimes it will uh, freeze uh, in the loading screen, and then it will be match in progress, and then I can't get back into the game, and it will result in me losing our uh, cups. But for me, like, majority of the problems are with versus attack. Um, also, a another thing is that with regards to formations, like, a lot of the formations seems to be getting... Uh, very similar chances like Every chance seems to be the same guys. It's really really strange regardless of which formation are you are using another problem guys Is that um, sort of the distribution of chances as well as who gets those chances? So for example in the 4-1-2-1-2 narrow um, Kante he gets the ball so frequently in verse attack. It's not even funny. He gets the ball 
more than my two center mids, my two strikers, and uh, even my cam. Like, he is probably involved in 80% of attacks, I would say. And obviously, that is not correct, guys. You know, the CDM shouldn't be involved as much in the attack as, you know, obviously your strikers or your central attacking midfielders. Nevertheless, you know, your center mids. Another big problem uh, with first attack is that there are huge freezes in first attack. Like, there's some instances where you'll be playing first attack and then the screen will freeze and it will just turn black for like 5-10 seconds and then your opponent will continue to score and there's literally nothing you can do about it and that's another thing that will cost you a game um, also one other thing that I've noticed is that the chance distribution you know because of the fact that you know good great and basic chances pretty much are the exact same uh, from what I've experienced anyway is that there's literally no difference in upgrading your team you know if you want to upgrade your team it's going to make a very, very little difference. I don't know, like, what's happening, guys, but I do hope that it is getting fixed. Um, like, for example, like, I faced a plus 4 or plus 5, and then the next game, I, I faced, like, someone who was, like, I think, like, 84, and it felt like the exact same opponent. It was absolutely crazy. What are some other issues that you guys have run into? Um, but I think that, like, those are maybe some of the main ones. I really think that ads need to be fixed, and uh, just gameplay in general needs to be reviewed. Um, also, there are still some problems with uh, League versus League corners. You get so many corners in League versus League, as well as like the infinite turned. But guys, let me know what other problems you have faced, and also what are your plans for Thanksgiving. This is Jamrat signing out for the day. Thank you all for everything, and peace.